How to become famous? So you've decided you want to become famous. Fame certainly has its perks, and you'll find there are many paths to get to fame. One of the best ones is to develop talent. Then you can market yourself and that talent to the world, building your base and making you famous. Keep in mind that it often takes a lot of work to become and stay famous. So if you're not willing to work hard, this path may not be the one for you. Plus, even if you work your hardest, you may still not become famous as it takes an element of luck as well. Number 1. Finding a path to fame Decide how famous you want to be. Fame comes at many different levels. For instance, you could be famous in your school or workplace. You could be famous in your hometown or your state. Alternatively, you could go for ultimate fame and attempt to be famous around the world. Each of these has its own unique pros and cons, so it's up to you to decide how much fame you want. Number 2. Create a unique solution to your problem Think about the problems in your life and in the world around you. If you can come up with a unique solution or a unique invention, you may become famous for it. For example, Marie Curie became famous as a scientist and inventor of the x-ray. Think about problems in your life. Maybe you're always late or you hate having to hunt around for your shoes every day. What solutions could you come up with to help yourself and others with these problems? Number 3. Stand out from other people Sometimes you'll get noticed for just being yourself, if you have a unique way of doing things or a unique way of looking at the world. The key is to go on your own way and be just who you are. You shouldn't change how you do things just because you do them in a unique or odd way. Break away from stereotypes. If you love to skateboard, find your own unique tricks. Instead of going for a typical skater look, find your own flair. Number 4. Audition for a reality show Another way people become famous is by going on reality shows. You don't necessarily need the talent to get on a reality show, though in some cases you'll need one, such as with singing shows. Look on the show's website to find out where and when you can audition. Generally, it helps with being enthusiastic when you audition, particularly about the show. Keep in mind, on reality competition shows, the judges may be tough or mean. Don't take it too personally though, it's a part of the show. Number 5. Be generous in a unique way While this may seem counter-initiative, some people become famous by doing something for other people in a really unusual way. It could be by making a large donation, but you could always just raise money in some way that's out of the ordinary. For instance, one man, Cy Berger, had famously long eyebrows, nearly 3 inches. When friends suggested that he let people shave them off to raise money for charity, he agreed and became famous in his hometown of Bloomfield, Indiana. For example, you could make it your goal to bake and sell a million brownies to raise money for a cause. Number 6. Work on a world record Another way you might become famous is by breaking a world record. Read through the world records and figure out if you could work on one to break. Keep in mind, your world record will likely need to be verified by a Guinness Book of World Records official. Plus, to truly get famous this way, you need to pick a record that people care about rather than just any record. Number 7. Post a silly video in a social media driven world, you can win 5 minutes of fame by posting a goofy video that takes the internet by storm. It doesn't have to be anything terribly difficult, it just has to be engaging and entertainment. It can involve something as simple as your cat doing something funny. You might post a video of you playing a funny song on your instrument or doing something funny in a public place. Get creative and make sure you're having fun. If you're enjoying yourself, your audience is more likely to like the video. Number 8. Pick a talent If you're naturally talented at something, that's a good place to start. However, the talent you pick should also be something you enjoy. You're going to spend many, many hours working on this talent, so if you don't enjoy it, you're going to be miserable. Plus, people can tell when passion drives your talent or skill, and it will be easier to become famous. Think about artistic careers like music, acting, writing, or painting. Keep in mind though, you'll have to sell yourself in any of these fields and build a name for yourself. We associate careers in the arts, such as actors and musicians, with fame. But any public figure qualifies as famous. Politicians, football coaches, local business owners, and even meteorologists are recognizable in the grocery store.
Number nine, learn from the best. Whatever talent you're trying to develop, you'll do better if you learn from others' expertise. That can mean taking classes in your field, finding a mentor, watching tutorials online, or reading books from the library. You can do all of the above. Number 10. Let others help you on your way. Practice, practice, practice. While there's some argument over whether you can make yourself a genius at something through practice, there's no doubt that practice makes you better. One magic number for how much time you have to put in is 10,000 hours. While you don't need to sit down and time that, it should make you realize the amount of time building a talent takes. For instance, if you put in 5 hours a week, it would take you 2,000 weeks or approximately 38 years to become an expert in an area. On the other hand, if you're able to put in 40 hours a week, you could become an expert in a little fewer than 5 years. Number 11. Remind yourself a talent is really a skill. If you just believe what you have is pure talent, then you're not likely to get at it. Any place you fall short, you think, well, I just don't have enough talent. However, if you think of it as a skill, then you have the mindset that you can get better at it. When you find yourself thinking, I'm just not very good at this, think this instead. I just need to work harder to learn this part of my skill. Number 12. Shape what you want the world to see. Personal brands rely on building a certain persona. It should rely on aspects of your character that are already there, but you don't necessarily want to or need to show your whole self to the world. Instead, you want to focus on what makes your brand unique. Think of celebrities you know that have built a persona for themselves. For instance, chefs like Rachel Ray and Guy Ferry have built their brands around a particular persona. Other examples include bloggers like Joy the Baker or the Pioneer Woman or YouTubers like Hannah Hart or the Fine Brothers. Number 13. Market yourself on social media. In the digital age, social media is the main way of getting your name out there. You can make posts or videos as well as blog or take photos to help build your brand. Your content should show who you are while also offering something to the user. You want to give them a reason to keep coming back. For instance, if you're trying to market your talent, put out videos where people can see your talent in action, such as your singing. On the other hand, you can focus on how to where you help people do what you do.